Uh, English is not great. I wish to try to explain you. Yes? Okay. We would like to start your dining experience with a kind of time travel. The chef's family has its origin in the countryside, in La Torre del Español, a small village near the Red Wine region. His great-grandparents were farmers who owned an olive grove called Faifo. We would like to welcome you to the restaurant with a small bite in a space inspired by the Atal olive grove. Yes? I hope you enjoy the experience. Please. Hello, hi. Hello. 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 The pegs you can see on the wall represent this olive grove as seen from the sky. Before moving to the dining room, we'd like to take a moment here to invite you to some appetizers and a menu. Okay, thanks. White, as you just laid down. And it has this color because it has no sugar added. It. It's really dry. The appetizers are based on the ingredients that the great grandfather of the chef, Cisco, took with him to my fork to have lunch. We start with a mimetic olive, made from two olives, albequina and piquan. Pick it up carefully and eat it all in one bite. A version of bread with tomato on the bottom, toasted bread, and the black rock is made of tomato, parsley, and anchovy. We finish with an interpretation of pollo a la catalana, a really common dish here of chicken. Is the skin of the chicken roasted on top, a pineapple motion, pate, prunes marinated in wine, and pine nuts. Enjoy. Uh, Alix uh, spuma uh, on top uh, crispy potato on top to finish a uh, small throw rock very important uh, the spoon on the bottom on top okay on top ah. in seaweed to finish a crispy brown very very important a one bite Enjoy. Two types of olive oil extra virgin. The first is big one, one by the It's an oil um, uh, uh, herbal flavor and delicate in the mouth. Okay. The second is Grossan and 10% Argosona, two variety. It's an oil uh, more intense, more fruity, and to finish, uh, it's a spicy. Okay? okay My recommendation is, is a star with uh, the butter and pickle and grossa. Okay? okay. Chef. This is a memory of the chef when the his grandma made this uh, beautiful uh, uh, soup. Can you take a video? Okay, yeah, no problem. Oh, okay. We're going to start filling this spherification of serra de cheese. This is a cheese from Catalonia with this uh, cream of the same cheese here. Yeah, with just this here. Okay. Okay. And you place in your bowl. In this crispy of the same cheese as uh, Serrade, and we are gonna finish now with this. This is the soup, this is the broth. 
Tron Figueras Onsio. and roasted onion reduction and two things and Iberian ham chip. Okay? Thank you. Thank you. Here you have braised oxtail, crispy sweet beds, mixed caramelized butter and squash, the next caramelization is a way of cooking food from the inside to the outside with a special kind of liquid, so in the inside it's cooked, but in the outside it's still tender. On top of the buttermilk squash, there's a mix of medieval spices called polvora del duc, that this mix already appeared on the first Catalan cooking book known. To finish, you have wild chantrel mushrooms, on top of all deep fried sage. This is a red wine reduction. And the spray, it's a sage vinegar. We recommend you to mix it both meat and sauce to eat it. Okay. Here you have Pyrene trout cooked at 43 degrees, done in 15 minutes. Surrounding the trout, a mushroom jelly. On the bottom, sauteed mushrooms. The dots of two colors are of grilled peppers. Here I'm serving this wild chanterelle mushroom that it has been braised on this barbecue with pine tree. And to finish this dish, this oil made of pine leaf and this sauce that is made of vermouth, cherry wine, and dill. Says this is the last serving dish of this will taste tasting menu. And it's a pairing again of pork and apple recipe here. We got two elaboration of pork. This tender lean fit has been marinated previously and after cook a little bit in the oven and it's wrapped in garlic and water press crumbs. We find the ribs of this pork, uh, the, the, the pulled pork, underneath this crispy of Gomesco sauce with the shape of pig. And the ribs have been marinated also in 12 different spices. On top, this brown bowl, this is a celeriac glaze puree and on the way this taco of green apple. We complete this course with this salad with more radish, more apple and cider as verification. And the sauce the more interesting thing this is a total great option we are going to pour the fillet for you for you too sir the first of the one with the dessert thank you so much a tangerine sorbet on the right a saffron curd at the bottom orange crumbs creamy white chocolate with vanilla and on top, a crisp, a crisp, sorry, of the tangerine skin. Thank you. Thank you. Conclude this menu with this main dessert. This is a memory of our chef when he was a child. There was a huge fig tree in his plot in Tarragona, and this is an interpretation of this memory. We find here uh, two elaborations uh, based on walnuts and figs. Basically, in the table walnut, we find this praline underneath with some uh, chocolate, white chocolate crumbs. There is a specification as well of uh, cream of, uh, of walnuts, and this is sponge cake just here made with uh, walnuts as well. And in terms of figs, we got two half of figs here in the natural way, painted a little bit with hibiscus honey, and the roasted one a little bit warm here, uh, painted with the same honey. <coughs> A small bowl of figs, this is a um, lacto fermented fig, and there is also this uh, compote of figs and red wine. The garlic is made with uh, orange uh, flour with cinnamon, and it's gonna create this atmosphere of autumn and winter here, pouring this cream of the, fig, the leaf fig into this liquid nitrogen here, minus 200 degrees to create the sensation of the foggy days in autumn and even winter days.
thank you. You take a look now to the plate, you will see this sensation of folly and white winter this circle. Thank you so much. Sir. On the left, a Catalan cream. On the right, lemon char. And so, a version of chocolate glaze with olive oil and chocolate. Okay. We recommend to start with a Catalan cream. Yes. One, two.